So this is the definition no, of the inverse hyperbolic function. That's the equivalent of the hyperbolic uh, sine, uh, the inverse of the hyperbolic sine x and other trigonometric function. Now moving forward to the derivative. How are we going to solve the derivative of the inverse of the hyperbolic function? Now let's uh, let's write the formula now. So ito yung form, etong formula, etong formula na to ang magiging guide natin in solving for the derivative ng inverse hyperbolic function. Now i-apply natin. So for our first example. First one we have getting the derivative of the inverse of the hyperbolic function 2x. Yan. So ang solution natin Siyempre, we follow lang the formula. Ano ba yung formula in getting the derivative of the inverse hyperbolic function ng sine? Ito yung formula niya. Formula is 1 over the square root of u square plus 1 times the derivative of du over dx. Sulat natin. That would be d over dx. U, ang formula niya is 1 over na yan, u square square root of u square plus 1 times the derivative of du over dx. Yan. So ito yung magiging guide natin in, in solving. Ayan yung formula natin and let's apply. Una muna, let's identify kung ano yung u natin. So kung meron tayong d over dx, the inverse hyperbolic sine 2x, Ang ating u, the value of letter u natin ay 2x. Yan. Kunin na, na, kunin na natin yung derivative ng du over dx, that is 2. Derivative nito, du over dx becomes 2. And we plug in sa ating formula. Plugging in sa ating formula, this becomes 1 over the square root of Ang value ng letter U natin, the U, ito, U. Kaya meron tayong 2x square plus 1 times the derivative of, yeah, derivative of du over dx. And this is our du over dx, 2. This becomes 2 over square root of 4x squared plus 1. And this is our final answer. Let's have the second one. We are going to find the derivative of the inverse of the trigon hyperbolic uh, tangent 5x plus 3. So how are we going to find the derivative of this one? Sulat ko muna yung formula no, para mas makabisado natin. This becomes the inverse of the tangent q. At ang, ang, the, ang formula niya, ang derivative niya is equal to 1 over 1 minus u square times the derivative of du over dx. So kung meron tayong inverse of hyperbolic tangent 5x plus 3, yan. identify muna natin kung sino ang ating u. That's the first step. Identifying the value of u. Oops. 5x plus 3. At ang ating u ay this one. So u is equal to 5x plus 3. Kunin na natin yung derivative niyan. Derivative of du over dx. Uh, derivative of 5x plus 3. This becomes 5. Yeah. Sulat natin ang ating formula. 1 over 1 minus u square. Ito yung letter U natin. Pa-plug in natin dito. So this becomes 5x 
plus 3 square times the derivative ng du over dx. Yan. So, derivative of this one. Ito ang ating du over dx. So, meron tayong times 5. Simplifying. So, this becomes 5 over 1 minus. Simplify natin to. Okay. So, we square the first term. <clears throat> Squaring the first term, that is 5x times 5x. That becomes 25x squared. Double the product of the first and the second term. So, 5x times 3, that's 15x. Times 2, that becomes 30x plus 30x. And then square the last term, 3 times 3, that is plus 9. So, rewrite lang natin. This becomes 5 over 1. And we need to multiply the outside negative to the inside function. This becomes negative 25x squared minus 30x minus 9. Or this becomes negative 25x squared minus 30x minus 8. Or write natin, this can be written as negative 5 over 25x squared x square plus 30x plus 8. So ito po ang ating final answer. Okay. So let's now move on to another example. Example number three. Let's say we are going to to get the derivative of the inverse of the hyperbolic function second second x solution. This would be our solution. And so let's na natin ang formula of the inverse of the hyperbolic cosine u, ang formula niya ay 1 over the square root of uh, u square, u square minus 1 times the derivative of the du over dx, times du over dx. Sulat natin yung problem natin. Okay, cosine inverse second yeah. the inverse of the hyperbolic cosine second x identify natin ang letter u natin this is our letter u u is equal to second x derivative of second x okay so getting the derivative of second x that would be second x tangent x and i-plug in natin sa ating formula. Ang formula natin ay 1 over the square root of ang ating letter u is this one. So it becomes second x square minus 1 times derivative of, I mean, times the derivative of du over dx or eto na siya. This one. So we have second x tangent x. Okay, so simplifying, this will become, multiply na natin, one, one times second x tangent x, it becomes second x tangent x over the square of second square x minus, minus 1. And, kung i-recall natin ang ating trigonometric identities, Sabi, so, sabi sa ating trigonometric identities, second square x minus 1 is just equal to tangent square x. So this can be written as the square root of tangent square x. So just a note. Second square x minus 1 
is equal to tangent square x. Rewrite lang natin. And simplifying second, second x, tangent x, and the square root of tangent square x I equal to tangent x. And cancel out to. The cancel out. So ang matitira na lang ay second x. So therefore, ang ating final answer is equal to second x. dy over dx tangent, inverse of the hyperbolic tangent cosine x. Now you try to solve this one.